This is Blackthorn Prod. I'm Noah, and in today's video, I wanted to share with you some cool tips on coming up with game ideas. So, you've surely had times when you were stuck. Stuck for days, weeks, and maybe even months with not a single interesting game idea in mind. The industry already seems filled to the brim with fascinating mechanics, characters, and game worlds to explore. Everything you think of or make may seem like a pale copy of an already existing creation. And so the goal of this video is to help you unlock your creative potential and come up with interesting, original game ideas. With that said, here is tip number one. Write a large list of random words from mechanics, colors, themes, characters, and then cut out these words to form a pile of little white cards. Close your eyes and pick three of these cards. Then make a game based on those three words. Now, this may seem a little silly, but I promise this can really help you come up with original, weird, fun ideas. Many times creative block can be due not because you lack ideas or inspiration, but because you have too much choice, too many ideas. By constraining yourself to three words, your brain will be able to focus and come up with creative and interesting connections, ultimately leading to a new game concept. Tip number two, think of one of your favorite games, be it a brutal 2D platformer, an exhausting top-down survival experience, a dark 3D combat-based game, and imagine the same game, but in a different dimension. In other words, imagine your favorite 2D platformer with its juicy mechanics and worlds, but has a game set in a 3D space from a first-person perspective. Chances are the game will feel and play very, very differently. For another more concrete example, imagine the top-down 2D roguelike game The Binding of Isaac, and picture it instead has a 3D FPS. Same game with permadeath, random level generation and so on, except being in that first-person perspective will drastically change many other elements of the creation, such as aiming, dodging enemies, and even the art, from 2D to 3D. With that said, let's move on to the third tip. Think of a known game or genre, and remove a key mechanic of that game or genre. Imagine a platformer where you can't jump. Or how about a card game where there are no turns, but both players use their cards simultaneously. Picture an action-packed game like Doom, without the frantic real-time element and instead based on a sort of turn-by-turn -turn combat system. As you can see, many very interesting ideas can be brought to life using this thought process. Tip number four to find some cool game ideas. Draw pictures. Even if you are a terrible artist and can only make quirky stick men, Take a couple sheets of paper and a good quality pen or pencil and begin making random doodles. Draw anything that comes to mind. Putting your thoughts down on paper with drawings can really bring to light interesting stories, characters, connections and ultimately, games. Alright, here comes the fifth and final tip. Take inspiration from the real world. Imagine a game based on something that actually exists on planet Earth, or a creation inspired from a certain situation or real-life experience. What sort of game would you make based on taking a phone call, reading, sleeping, or even eating? Get the habit of looking around you and try and see how even the most boring of situations, items, or locations could be turned into some fun, atmospheric, or interesting experience. Alright, we've gone through a bunch of cool ways to come up with game ideas. 
I hope you found at least one tip that will help you unlock your creative potential and begin work on a brand new creation. If you liked these tips, tell me so in the comment section down below and I'll be delighted to make in the near future another video on the same topic with an extra bunch of ways to come up with game ideas. Until then, stay tuned, have a great day, remember to support me and my channel by hitting the like and subscribe buttons, and with that, I'll see you very soon. Cheers!